Hi, my name is Avery Martinez. The purpose of my project is that I will predict what I think there is an abundance of bacterial growth at Holland Family College Ready High School by swabbing the seed door now from the entrance on room 220 on the Wednesday before lunch to see how much bacteria it has. My swabbing area will be in the seeds inside doorknob. I will be setting up a petri dish to see how it looks. In day three, my bacteria has a circular shape. It's colored, it's cream, and it has an entire margin, and its size, it's small. In day seven, my bacteria has changed. It has an irregular shape, it's colored, it's cream, and a little brownish in the middle, and it has an undulate margin, its size is big. How bacteria replicates is by binary fusion. It is the splitting of a parent cell into two daughter cells. It is asexual production and prokaryotes. How you can prevent contagion is by washing your hands because it might have bacteria. And another way could be by staying away from people who are sick, like for example, a person with a cold can spread the infection by coughing or sneezing. What are prokaryotes? Bacteria are prokaryotes. A prokaryote is a single cell or unicellular organism. Many scientists believe that prokaryotes were the first organisms on Earth. Bacteria has three basic shapes, a round shape called cocci, a rod shape called bacilli, and a spiral shape. There are also detrimental bacteria types. One is Clostridium, it is shaped like a rod shape. It infects, it infects and can make humans ill as well as other animals. The symptoms are tummy ache, watery diarrhea, blood stains, skulls, and Elevated body temperature. It commonly occurs in people who have recently had a course of antibiotics and are in hospital. An example for beneficial bacterium is lactobacillus. It is a rod shape and produces lactic acid through the fermentation of carbohydrates. It is found in foods like yogurt, milk, and certain cheeses. It can help with breakdown food. Absorb, absorb nutrients and fight off on friendly organisms. Based on the bacteria I've collected on my petri dish from the sea store, now bacteria could be everywhere. They are so small that you can't even see them.